Hello YouTube! I'm Quantum Fear and welcome to my walkthrough of Arkham Asylum. This is the first of two videos to show how to go through your first visit to intensive treatment. We start the video after the open cinematics and the long journey down to the cells. At this point, the Joker has already escaped and the game starts the fight tutorial. Now let's get this party started. Okay, the open fight. Uh, and this is just the, you know, the, actually your very first fight in the game. Uh, the idea is just to, to learn the free folk combat and to uh, understand all it really takes to do is uh, take the, it takes a hidden strike command. Um, really, it's as complicated or as simple as you really want it to be. Um, I jump around a lot here because I know I can, um, but you know it's really how, what you're comfortable with and what you what you know already. Next part is a tutorial on um, the tower move, which basically says that when you see the little lightning bolts above their head, the blue ones, then um, you hit the counter button and you're and Batman will just wrap them up and you'll get a chance to hit them. You won't have to hurt at all. Uh, as a general like hit um, in fights, you don't really want to mash the buttons. Um, it's amazing how just a, a controlled one tapping on it will work. It'll let you switch to your stuns or your um, counters as you need to, opposed to just being stuck in the animation and then ending up getting hit. And once you're done with the, the counter one, you, you move around a, a bit. You can actually get the, your first Riddler clue here in the vent. Just gotta grab that. And then you run up here, and the um, the whole time the Joker's you know taunting you. Once he drops the uh, gates here, you just turn left and you take the three um, teeth that are sitting there, and continue running. You know, taking up picking up any uh, chattering teeth that uh, that is along the way. I think there's two of them. Then you just kill, uh, get these two uh, bad guys real quick. Now, just to know, uh, the counter command will not. Generally, unless they're the only ones, actually have you attack the person. Um, you actually need, once you hit the counter and you start countering, you need to physically start hitting the strike command again. So once you're done with that, those guys, just run up to uh, this guy waving his hands, and you get a, a, a brief cinematic where he says you have to go help one of his friends. And then you just go back around the corner and you talk to uh, Oracle for the first time. And here you f find about out about Zaz, who is holding a uh, guard hostage. All you need then, uh, what this ends up being is a tutorial on how to uh, ascend to the gr to the gargoyles, which is a huge part in this game, and use the grapple gun and, at all. This is disgraceful. How did a patient like Victor get free? We'll worry about that later, Doctor. You don't he need to talk to, to the doctor, the guard, by the way, you know? but you do he actually hear her voice in some of the um, voice recordings that you pick up along the island. You do have to talk to the guard, though. Otherwise, you won't um, let you know about detective him. vision do or uh, the Keep ability to jump from uh, gargoyle to, to gargoyle. I've got to get close enough to Zaz to strike. He'll see me coming on the ground, so I'll stay up high. These old gargoyles should be able to support Once you get up there, you just gotta get to one that's slightly behind them. I actually go all the way to the back and get them this way. But you can actually do it from the sides too. The whole point though is that once you get them down, just make sure to uh, do a ground attack and um, that way he'll stay down. And you'll get another cinematic real quick with uh, Harley Quinn. After that, you uh, have you can roam around a bit. And you actually wanna go on the opposite side of the room and pick up this uh, question mark real quick. And then go back to where you started and yank that one out and then you, you're uh, free to uh, continue on. Grabbing, you know, grabbing that very obvious question mark. They're pretty much, that's just saying here, take this. Don't forget to grab any uh, teeth along the way. And this part, uh, you got to wait. It won't even let you grapple up until the cinema this uh, brief t dialogue is done. But once you can get up there, just jump your way back up there and uh, rip the grate off. And uh, follow the vent to the next area. <coughs> This is kind of like a this mini challenge area where it's just telling you about jumping Joker across a uh, whole uh, 
holes, I guess. Please. And you're uh, gonna be blinding. Stay here. Batman's here. Just hold on a little longer, Steve. I can't. I'm going after the animal who did this. Batman, the extraction system. Steve Just glide down to this guy. Now you don't actually have to save him, uh, but you do get an achievement for doing it. An actual achievement, achievement. And once you get him, you just uh, chuck a battering at the box, and it'll turn the fans on, and you can get out of there. Um, making sure to grab the teeth that are uh, sitting right there. You got that. You grab the uh, in the showers. There is another one in the vent in the, the drain. And grab two more up here. One. Now I think that's the only, that's going to be the only time I actually show you that the upgrades screen. In my opinion, the best upgrades for someone who hasn't done this before is to get the uh, all the health ones first, because with more health you can survive longer. Uh, definitely the way to go. Okay, so here we are. This is a, your first Titan match. Now you don't have to do do this the way I do, which is basically wait for him to charge, throw a battering at him, and you run through the wall. You can get up there and then you hit him and then jump over him and hit him, jump over him. It's a lot harder. It's much easier just doing that. So uh, enjoy. Uh, just watch the fight. And um, I, that's the end of this part one of this video. I will see you guys on part two. the record, you can usually get about eight shots in there to times eight before you have to get out of the way. Um, if you don't get that much, then it's not a big deal. It's not like you have any takedowns or anything that, that matters to it. So just keep at it, and eventually you'll have the you'll do double ground pound. In case that means it's hard to blow up, and that's the end of the level.